guys, welcome back to another video. Just so you know, real quick, we have fixed our solar because we got some more solar panels. So thank we're- Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you so much everyone who contributed to that. That was so beyond kind of you. Um, but for this video, we actually realized this morning when we woke up that the first ever video we posted on this channel, I can't even remember, what was it called? It was Welcome to My New Home. Welcome to My New Home. Yeah, it was actually before Chad and I were even together or before I knew that we would be going on this journey well, that makes sense. This journey together. Yeah, really before Living Zeal had kind of an identity. Yeah, exactly. And it was one year and three days ago. It was on June 26th, I believe. Um, and it's just been a crazy year. We've been looking back over everything we've accomplished, everywhere we've been, how Living Zeal has grown, how many of you guys we've met and connected with. And we just kind of wanted to take a minute to reflect back over everything and also talk about what's coming in the future for us and our school bus. Hello from inside the bus. Um, so some of you watching this, friends and family, already know what I'm doing. I bought a bus in Denver last Monday. I am converting it into a tiny house on wheels. And yeah, not really sure how long this whole process is gonna take, but my brother is going to the army in less than two months, meaning our lease is up in less than two months. So that's kind of like, my time frame, six weeks ideally. It's about me wanting to free up more time and space in my life for the things that I value and the things that I love. We are guaranteed this moment right now, and that is it. We are disillusioned with time and thinking that it's ours and it's not ours. Just to overlay this with a little bit more emotional stuff that is layered into this decision. We all know um, Aunt Jean died um, last May. Anyway, and it's made me... There's one thing that this has taught me. It is, again, that life is so short and life is fleeting. And if there's a life if you're not living the life that you want to be living, if you're not in alignment with yourself, if, if your time is not your own, if it's actually your bosses or your teachers or your friends or whatever it is, if, if you're not making decisions for yourself, for your life, for the life you want to live, you're cheating yourself. So yeah, bus, conversions, I've seen people do it. Do I know how they do it? No, I don't know how they do it but they have videos and I shall figure this out. And this is probably gonna be the biggest thing, biggest challenge I have encountered in terms of like time, knowledge, resources, but I have this unwavering feeling in my heart, in my soul that has overcome my entire being that this is the right thing to do and that the universe will provide. crazy to think back to where I was a year ago recording that video and kind of just at that time that was the first catalyst the first big emotional thing in my life that was just driving me forward and I had had all these big dreams for such a long time to live in Hawaii to own my own house to live off off grid and it was just that that made me see that now was the time to harness the moment and pursue my dreams without looking back and it's so true that that has happened. Like we, we've yeah. done so much, we've accomplished so much. I think it's that exactly that we've been trying to uh, to um, encapsulate with Living Seal. Sort of that feeling that you get when something huge happens to you, catastrophic. Hopefully, it doesn't take someone dying for you to like wake up and realize. That's kind of yeah. what Living Seal we hope is to you is a wake up call. It's sort of like, wow, I can do this. Anyone can do this. Yeah. So at that point in our lives, we had no idea what Living Seal really was. We just knew we felt this calling to do this, and we needed to document it. To learn on the road, like yeah. for those of you guys sitting at home that are thinking you want to be doing what we're doing, one, it's totally doable. We come from very normal, humble background. We've been servers for most of our lives. Yeah, actually. exactly. We worked in the restaurant industry and I think that we've been really willing to learn the entire way so we had no idea how to like do YouTube, how to really thrive on social media and it's still been a learning process. Oh yeah, so we realized YouTube was a great place to Good share knowledge. knowledge. Yeah, because that's what we went there for, for the initial build. So we want to yeah. share our knowledge, which is 
it's so funny watching this exact same process happen with all the other channels. But so you start off showing people how you do things, uh, how you did your build, like. what your bus looks like, tour your videos, band. yeah. And then we really enjoyed making videos that we were proud of that were soulful to us. Yeah, we kind of make videos with the intention of like videos that we want to share with our kids someday. Exactly. So it had to transition from more like informative how to to kind of getting a deeper delve into what our experience has been living in a bus, living alternatively. We don't want to make content just about stuff that we've learned on the bus. We want to make content that feels true to us. So yeah, it was in late December uh, that we started doing vlogs that really meant something to us. And um, we lost a lot of subscribers, to be honest with you. A lot of people left our channel uh, because they were there for just the how-to stuff and they didn't really care about our lives. But then we gained you guys. Yeah. And let me just throw a number out there that we are blown away with. When we started, when we were doing how-to videos, 8% of our subscribers were watching our videos. 8% when we were doing how-to stuff. Now that we're doing vlogs, last time I checked it was in the mid-30s. Yeah. Which is unbelievable. 30-some percent of you are our subscribers and before it was such a small amount. And so that just means that it's confirmation to us. Yeah, well, and I think that the big thing to take home from that too is that it shows that people are here to connect more than anything and human relationships are the biggest thing that are going to push you forward in life. Um, so I think that once we started being more genuine and authentic with what we were sharing, our subscriber base got more engaged and that can be the exact same thing for you. We started realizing that something that's even more powerful and more priceless on YouTube, more than to offers, is inspiration. Yeah. So we realized that about six months ago, uh, about around the same time that we decided to go to Hawaii. Yeah. All right, hey friends, welcome to another video. Um, we're gonna be doing this one a little different. Uh, we've been doing all how-to videos for like a couple a months while. now. And um, we're gonna just kind of talk about our lives. We, we actually talk about our life in phases and we do a lot. Um, totally. And it helps us It helps us to understand. Stay like, motivated too. To stay motivated. So we're in phase one right now, which is just living out of our conversion, making Living Zeal something that can help us get to phase two, which is now gonna be Hawaii, doing a van conversion, documenting all that for you guys, and then doing all the how-tos on homesteading that we're going to do out there. So that's going to be phase two. Phase three is going to be us having uh, having kids and making a family out there, which we're really excited for. Super excited about. So it's been six months since we made that video about going to Hawaii, and don't by any means think that we put that on the back burner. Um, we realize that if you want to live the life you want to live, a lot of times it takes putting in a lot of hard work yeah. because money isn't free. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I think that, you know, when the idea of Hawaii came up for both of us, it was something that I was individually really passionate about, and Chad was too, and already lived in Maui. Um, I think it's just one of those things that seemed like too big of a dream for the longest time. Like, before I embarked upon... Hey guys. <laughs> two big people. <laughs> Before I embarked upon this journey, like I really saw the world with a lot of limitations and Living Zeal has just kind of cracked me wide open and made me see that anything is possible. Plus this guy just has this mentality that I guess you were just born with that you can literally strive to do anything and then do it. Like anything is possible. That's my mom. Thanks mom. <laughs> <laughs> um, which is amazing. It's incredible. But at the same time, there is like a lot of struggle that you might have to go through in order to get the things that you want in life. We don't want to ever come off to you guys as like, that this is easy, or we're just skating by. Like it takes effort to keep Living Zeal going and it's gonna take a lot more effort to save the amount of money that we need in order to make this like our big dream happen, which is shipping our bus to Hawaii, moving our cats to Hawaii, and planting our feet there for a while, who knows so, how long. So, I'm, I'm gonna tell you guys where we've come to in the past six months of that video about going to Hawaii to where we are right now. Okay. Um, We've saved all of the money that we've made from Google AdSense. So basically, watching this video, uh, if you watch it 10 times, that'll give us like a cent. And that'll go into our Hawaii account. Two and a half cents, maybe. Two and a half cents. And we really just don't mess with that money. We've let it sit there and it... it it's accrued slowly. It's probably at like $1,200. Yeah, I think it's about $1,200. Yeah, from so last October. So that's great. It's not going to get us to Hawaii, though. So we did some math. It is great. It is great. Thank you so much for watching the videos. <laughs> um, we have over 500,000 views right now, that's amazing. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, we realized that if we keep going at that pace, then we're not going to make it to Hawaii by winter. We really wanted to get there before it got cold here again. So we decided that since we're enjoying it so much here and the cats are liking it, 
we're just going to try to pick up some shifts. Um, I'm going to try to pick up shifts on like a larger scale and Chad's going to be mainly focusing on keeping Living Zale going at the exact same rate that it has been. So we're going to keep releasing videos on Wednesdays, Fridays, Saturdays and doing our live stream. We'll probably do them a little bit later in the day. We're just going to continue to save money um, as much as we can and make this dream a reality before winter. If any of you guys watch the channel Max and Lee, she just posted a video not too long ago that she's going, she's leaving them in Guatemala, Aki and I can't remember what her boyfriend's name is, and went home to Canada to kind of work and save some money. So when I saw that video, I think that's when a light clicked in my head of like... It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's like okay. We're not like van we life, bus life frauds. We're yeah. just realizing that we have bigger dreams in mind and we're also very happy where, we're at, where we are. So this isn't a huge sacrifice for us. But we want to be really transparent with you guys because we have a lot of awesome stuff to share with you in the coming months and we're really excited about it. We're willing to work really hard this summer and pursue our dreams like full throttle. We're going yeah. to Hawaii, people. Thank you so much for watching another video, you guys. Uh, don't forget to like, share, or subscribe to this video if you like to not share with your friends. Comment down below as well. And uh, check out our Patreon page. Yeah, definitely. Also, if you haven't been to livingzeal.com, it's a pretty cute website, our website, and we have lots of blog posts up there, behind the scenes photos, videos, all kinds of good stuff. So yep. make sure to check that out as well. And a special thanks to these folks. Yes.